Greetings, this is Raymond Mayfield. We serve a great, big, wonderful God. I'm so glad to come to you today and tell you about how good God really is. I'm so thankful for the goodness of God. I want to talk to you about Psalms 19 and verse 1. The heavens declare the glory of God and the work of His hands. Day unto day and night after night, knowledge and speech, and there is no place on this universe where he is not heard. All you have to do is look up into the heavens and the sky at night and recognize we serve a great, big, wonderful God. He is all-powerful. He's not, uh, there's not anything he can't do. He's all-seeing. He's all-knowing. He's everywhere at one time. That is a wonderful thing. We serve a living and a true God. I want to just talk to you about this heavens. And when I talk about the heavens today, I want to describe the heavens as being the sky and those things that are above it. And we know that there's eight planets that go around the sun all the time, and they're traveling at incredible rates of speed. It's been estimated in 185,000 miles to a lot faster than that. I'm not smart enough to tell you just exactly how fast we're going through this space, but I can tell you we're going at an incredible rate of speed. And this is amazing fact that we're living on a planet Earth where God has created us. And God has put us here on this earth that we might serve a living God and that we might acknowledge Him as our Lord and Savior. Genesis 1 and 1 says, In the beginning God created the heavens and the earth. And there was darkness upon the face of the deep, but the Spirit of God moved up on the face of the waters. God created the light. He created all the stars that we see in the heaven. There's millions and millions of stars in, in this universe. Uh, and there's a lot of things that are trying to be discovered all the time, and no one will ever be able to figure out all the things that are out there, because no one is as big as God. As smart as we are in all our education, it's incredible how far we have come in educational things. And it, it is, is amazing to me how brilliant people we've got and scientists and people that can give us discoveries. But folks, as much work as we do, we'll never figure out how big God is. We'll be just little in His sight. And I say the heavens declare the glory of God. Day and the night utters His speech and knowledge. There is no place where his word cannot be heard. Thank you for listening to this broadcast today, and I'll talk to you real soon.